today. Yes, Sabrina Silva is in Woodland for a special birthday party. Good morning. <laughs> Yes, you know, we're here for a 21st birthday celebration. <laughs> Just kidding. It's actually Mr. Reed Anderson's 100th birthday tomorrow. Awesome. tomorrow. Yes. yes, are you excited? Yes, very excited. So many things are happening to me at all at once, you know. Oh, <laughs> yeah. yeah. And guys, he does not look one bit like he's 100, and he's a World War II vet. Went through a lot. I yeah, know you were man. sharing a couple of stories with me. Okay. Yeah, I landed in Africa in uh, uh, 1942 uh, with Patton was there, and uh, we went on through and made a beach landing in Sicily and one in Italy, and then I was six months in the hospital. Out of the hospital, back to the front lines at Anzio Beachhead. Wow. Two or three days back there. And they uh, hit me in the leg, and then I says to myself, you know, those Sunday guns are trying to kill me. <laughs> and now 100 years, yeah, and, and you're I, like, nope. And I was on the hospital ship coming home when they hit D-Day. Wow, and that's all wonderful. Well, and, and thank and you. Another thing, mm -hmm. Eisenhower, who was running that thing, in Fort Lewis, Washington in 1940, on maneuvers, I carried a battery pack for Eisenhower and worked with him. So wow. I had some interesting times. That is phenomenal, and, and we do we do want to thank you so much for your service. Um, we don't want to leave that out. But I also want to show you guys the things that he does on the side, which is extremely creative. He makes these sculptures out of glass, right, Mr. Anderson? Stained glass, yes. And you actually put some for auction. Yes, I yes. So I, we had an auction at the friends. Uh, Thing up in Yuba City about a week ago, there was 500 people there, and they raffled auction off one of my airplanes, my jewelry boxes, and a knife I had for something like $3,200. Wow! The airplanes are kaleidoscopes. Oh, okay, yeah, they are. And I, guys, I looked at it; it's awesome. But that shirt <laughs> that you're looking at right now, it's a little bit different now. Mr. Anderson actually has just one day left before he turns 100. And what is, what are you going to be wishing for? I don't know. I just, uh, I can't really say. I just do my thing every day. <laughs> I sit in my shop there. I got a TV in my workroom and a computer in my workroom and I watch uh, old western movies or, <laughs> and I watch the A's game all the time they're on. And uh, that's about all I do. Just uh, my bowl twice a week too. Besides oh, okay, that. Yeah. okay. And then I work out at the gym at five o'clock every morning. Oh my gosh, I need to rethink my life right now. Yes. <laughs> at 25, I can't even wake up at like 12 o'clock in the afternoon to go to the gym. So right now I'm work <laughs> I'm working out right now of uh, throwing the baseball because. On July 4th, uh, they asked me to come down and throw the baseball out at the Oak, at the Oakland A's game, which oh, would cool. really be an honor. Yeah, well, we're yeah, we're really excited to see that. We are wishing you the best of luck on that pitch, Mr. Anderson, and congratulations too on being an Elks member for 41 years. Yes, yes. Um, and we do want to wish you a happy birthday from Good Day Sacramento. Thank you so much for having us come here this morning and celebrate some of it with you and sharing a little bit of your life with us. And Thanks. yeah. Thank you very yeah, much. congratulations on making it 100 years young. Yes. <laughs> Thank you very much. Yeah, well, there you go, guys. You have it. This man, clearly, there's there's no reason why we can't be going to the gym. I or, know. You know, we can't be living life to the fullest. <laughs> I feel very so. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Well, thank you so much, Mr. Anderson. Yes. Well, take care, awesome. guys. We'll toss it back turn to you. Turning 100 and goes to the gym every day at every 5 a.m., and then Sabrina drops the ball.